Hi, I'm Dave Cuthbertson from Square Mile Systems. I'm going to show you how the Diagram Publisher module of our Visio Utilities will allow you to quickly and easily apply data graphics to multiple Visio diagrams and to automate the publishing of Visio diagrams to the web and PDF. Here we have a computer rack drawing of Visio and if we look down at the bottom we have all of these different tabs uh, with all the different racks within a computer room and this is typical of the automated output from systems like our AssetGen software. If I wish to apply a data graphic I could select them individually and apply a graphic which in this case is going to bring out the text so that I can then see uh, what the IP addresses are and what the types of components are as we go uh, progress. But do I really want to do this across 100 diagrams if I have 100 racks? And the answer is this is where our Visio Utilities will do this for you. So if you click on the SMS Utilities and do the Apply Data Graphics section in the Diagram Publisher module, this will then analyze all the pages and see which data graphics apply to each page. So we could do it by page and we can see that page 2 we can either delete all the data graphics or apply equipment types. Or we may do it the other way around, where I could delete all data graphics from every page. But what I want to do is apply this equipment type data graphic to all of these pages in one go. I click Apply. And this is now finished and published. So if I now zoom out here, we can now see every single component with data graphics. And if I skip through all the various pages, you can now see that they all have the same data graphic applied for consistency and this doesn't matter whether I have 10 racks or a thousand so that's an example of applying one data graphic to multiple pages within a Visio file. Let's look at another example. Here we have an example of two Visio diagrams this one is showing the data flow between different applications and we also have within the same Visio file a completely different type of diagram which is a, an ITIL service map showing the dependencies between hardware, virtual and database systems. I have two different data graphics here, one showing the support status and the other showing the recovery plan status of all of these components. And maybe I want to see both of them and apply them in different ways across the different diagrams. The way we do this with our utilities is yet again choose the utilities, apply data graphics, and let's apply a particular data graphic called support status across both pages. So here we can see we have color coded everything in green that is currently supported by the manufacturer. Red is no longer supported and amber is they are currently in their phase out for the end of life. And the same also with the software maps. If I wish to see the recovery plan status from the same diagrams Yet again, I choose Utilities, Apply Data Graphics, and now let's look at the recovery status. And the icons that you see there, ticks, we have a recovery plan, and any other ones were either uncertain or the plan has not been tested on both the little service maps. So this way, one diagram can serve multiple viewpoints by the use of data graphics. A third example is where we have a floor plan of a computer room and now what we want to do is to publish this with all the different viewpoints into a web or a PDF format. So for instance uh, if I select all of these different racks here I can see that I have multiple data graphics. Uh, this one for instance shows us by color coding the function and the types of the racks. Uh, this one here shows a color coding by the amount of space within the racks. So you can choose the different uh, perspectives this one shows you which racks are exceeding their power limits. So effectively one diagram is now a dashboard looking at capacity and functionality from different viewpoints. I can automatically publish all these viewpoints in their own files to the web or to a PDF and this is how we do it. We choose the SMS Utilities, save as web PDF and what we're going to do is we're going to take this computer room and we're going to choose the particular data graphics we want. So we want to have the cabinet function, the cabinet power status, and the space utilization as apply those three data graphics. And as we do this, also put them all into this directory. We can save as HTML or PDF, but we'll save as uh, HTML to give an example.
we finish the, the publishing, if we close this down now and open up Internet Explorer, here now are three web published views of the same Visio diagram done automatically. So this is the cabinet power status. This is by cabinet function. And this is by space utilization. And these could be put onto an intranet portal and automatically updated every night if you wish. So I hope that shows you how we can apply data graphics to multiple diagrams and automatically publish them to web or PDF form, selecting only what's appropriate for the audience turning Visio into a much more useful tool and reducing the effort to keep things up to date. You can download those utilities from the Square Mile Systems website. Uh, please have a look at our Visio training courses. You may find that some of the techniques we have uh, could help and assist you and we're only showing you a small amount of the capabilities of Visio, particularly in an organizational perspective. And many of the outputs I've shown you were automatically generated themselves from our AssetGen infrastructure management system.